Baxi's always been the place to work and I was lucky enough to get a start at Baxi's in 87. So I'm in my 29th year. I started the business when I was 20 years old. I've been here 31 years. I started in 1983, so it's almost 33 years. I've been here 27 years. I started at Baxi August 31st, 1987. Don't ask me when I got married, I can't remember that, but I can remember that. I started as a temporary worker and I had a contract for 12 months and 31 years later I'm still here. A request came around, could we have two people to go into the paint plant at Brownish Road for three months? And uh, I understand now why you don't volunteer because that was 28 years ago. <laughs> I've started a Baxi customer support in 2003 as an advisor. Started on the shop floor as a temporary shop floor operator building boilers. Well, it all started in 2009 when I came here for my high school work experience and here I am now. I joined the company uh, as a melter and I stand here today. I'm proud to be a senior manager with the company. Such a lot of history and there's people who've worked here for 30 or 40 years and then there's younger people who they treat with respect. All the boilers that Bakhti did were just a burner and a thermocouple. I could take you into Park Torina and I could show you all those bits. I redesigned that tool, I redesigned that tool. I started building gas fires and Brazilian wall heaters. Yeah, it was like the end of an era when uh, all the gas fires went. Times do change and as the cast iron died, aluminium was the new material and it proved to be our silver lining. And I'm pleased even at my age, advanced age of 71, that I'm still working and still able to take on board that new knowledge. What you find at Baxi's is it's quite a family firm. It's meant a lot to me over the years. My mum used to work in the wages department and my dad was with the maintenance that was in the late 60s and my husband's worked here since he left school so it has been a big part of my life and I do hope that I see my working days out here. I've got five children and a wife and an house and I've got everything I need and Baxi have been a big part of it for 28 years so I have to be thankful to Baxi. My family life, my children, you know, have all benefited. I feel lucky to have had this stability in my life really. It's just been there, you know, it's all I've known for 33 years. Grown up with Baxi, it has been a part of my life and it's always been there and I've always known about it and it's a local company and it's nice to work for a local company. Thankfully I've moved around many departments, many different jobs, new challenges. Every day is different and that's what I like. I wouldn't have stayed for 20 years if I didn't, didn't enjoy it. I think what the 150 years has demonstrated is the company's ability to adapt and to change. I've seen sites close, I've seen sites open. Along that journey, one thing we have done, thankfully, is kept that soul of the business. It has highs, it has lows, but it, it always comes out on top eventually. People are open to change. They've given the best years of their life at Baxi. Yeah, I think I've done my bit. And the older I get, the more dedicated I am. I think it's gone hand in hand, you know, I feel committed to the business and I feel the company's been committed to me. Baxi gave me an awful lot first and I built up my confidence in being a foreigner in a country. It was Baxi that gave me that opportunity to grow. I was devastated when I broke my back on my motorbike, you know, you can imagine. And suddenly, overnight, bang, you wake up the next day how can I possibly carry on? How am I going to make any money? And I thought, engineering, that's it. And I was lucky to be offered a job at Potterton. They gave me that opportunity, which was almost a big dead year, you know. A second chance, I didn't want to waste it. I was determined I was not going to fail. The way I've been brought up, etc., that you should always try your best. But I like to think through the members of the team who I've been associated with over the years of, of delivering and achieved quite a lot for Baxi. You're only as good as your team, that's the way I see it. I look after them, they look after me, the company looks after us, and that's the way it should be. And I'm proud of everybody who's been here a long time because we are us, there was no Baxi. Out of the 150 years, uh, yeah, that's 29 years of, of my story.
think we've got a very strong foundation. The ownership structure now allows us to look long term rather than short term. With the world changing as quickly as it is now, innovation is going to be at the heart of our next 150 years. You've got to change to keep up with the manufacturing industry on a whole. We are investing in future developments. We're forward thinking. We're looking at ways to make a difference. I'm passionate about looking at something and thinking we can improve that. I think we're going to continue doing that for many, many years, you know. The business is changing from a management culture to a leadership culture. Bringing in the mission, vision and values and, you know, putting a real focus around those it makes the journey so much more enjoyable when it's wrapped around these values which are core to how we do business together and with our customers. We're very much more customer focused. The call centre is based all around the customer and the customer experience. The innovation and the new ideas that come with that solution, I think they're the things that are going to differentiate us. But ultimately it's about the people. For 150 years you need good people to survive that long and we need those people to continue on during the next 150 years. That's what makes great companies great. As Philip Baxendale said, we're just the custodians of this business. We are focused on the new blood coming through. At the moment our focus is on getting the best people we possibly can to work in our business. Bax is passionate about the people and about bringing them through the company. There is opportunity that come along and if you show anything there are people out there who will invest in you. They invest time and effort in uh, making sure that you develop those skills and then utilise those skills to the full. Every step of the way Baxi have supported me in doing the right qualifications to move forward. You feel like you want it. When I joined the business as an engineer, I was really interested in how things worked, taking things apart, putting them back together. And I'm really lucky now that I can lead a team of people and also head up innovation. When I wake up in the morning, I enjoy and I have a smile on my face knowing that I come to work. I work in an environment that I really enjoy. I've enjoyed working here, so I think that helps when you enjoy what you do. I pride myself to try to bring some happiness and some enthusiasm to those around me. And by doing so, then I ensure that every other person that they touch takes a little bit of that away. I see myself at Baxi. I don't see any reason why I want to leave. It's been great and I've thoroughly enjoyed my time at Baxi and, and, and continue to do so. Very proud. It's definitely an employer I would recommend to my family and my friends. I suppose it's supposed to be made because I'm proud of that. I'm very proud of that. <laughs>